Rachel Amar. I'm 16 years old and I started coming to Body and Brain three months ago. I was in a very bad place with my mental health. I was having a lot of academic stress and pressure. I was um, really overdoing it, like a lot of extracurricular activities. It got to a point where I was really neglecting myself. There were days where I couldn't even sit in classroom. Like I would just break down crying, like in the, go to the bathroom by myself, and just like feel completely lost and empty. And I would spend like at least three days a week sitting in the guidance counselor's office at my school. So many thoughts were going through my mind and I was really curious just about like, what is my purpose here? And the really pivotal moment for me when I decided that I, I needed to do something was um, towards the end of the year, my grandmother um, who lives in the Dominican Republic got, um, had a heart attack. So my mom took a trip there. She was planning on going for just two weeks Two weeks then became four weeks, four weeks then became two months, and my mom ended up spending three months in Dominican Republic. So during that time I was, you know, taking care of my two younger brothers, trying to like get through high school. So then I decided if I'm 16 and I have this much stress and I feel this terrible, then what's gonna happen 10 years from now if I don't do something to better myself. So I went on Google and I was like, all right, I'm gonna try yoga because why not? Like I have friends that do it and they, they're really flexible and like they seem really like centered all the time. So I was like, okay, I looked up yoga and Central Park Avenue, which is where the Westchester Body and Brain Center is, is a street that I take every day to get to school. And I've always passed by the Body and Brain Center on the way to school. And I'm always like, huh, yoga, huh, Tai Chi. I wonder what that is. Just reading the reviews, like the energy from this center just drawed me in. Like I came in, it was a Monday, and I had my private session with my Wanjanim, Master Joe. And after the session, you know, I've, I obviously like cried a lot. <laughs> and then I came out just like feeling like I got the answer for exactly what I was looking for. Normally I expect someone 18 or older to show up in the center, but this young girl showed up in my center seemingly looking sad and kind of having a hard time. She came in, she shared her passions and what she wanted to do in her life and, and her obstacles, which were dealing with issues around her family and losing motivation in society as a young person. She kind of jumped right on board. She was coming to class very diligently and within a month, she brought her mother in. My daughter was going through a lot of um, emotional and stress at school and we tried doctors therapy and nothing worked. And then she told me, I need you to drive me to a yoga place. I'm gonna do meditation. So um, since that moment, she keep coming every day and I see a tremendous changes on her. Now she's a member and now my grandmother actually moved with us to New York and she's doing a lot better. And she's actually a member also. <laughs> my mom, they told me on uh, March that she was gonna leave eight months. She have, she needed a heart transplant, and the cardiologist told me she's gonna last eight months and then do the nice thing for her because she's gonna go. We, I took her here behind the hospital, three weeks later, being in Mount Sinai in Manhattan. She get out of there, then she started the practice, and now she's a member. ¿Cómo, ¿Cómo te sientes después de, de, de hacer las clases, mami? Me, ya tengo fuerza en la rodilla que no tenía. Fue con un carro que yo caminaba. Yeah, she used to walk with the, the car. Ya no lo creo. And she doesn't need it no more. It's been dumped in the garage. It was totally a <laughs> life-changing experience. And my mom and I completed BMT in August together. And in November, we're going to do um, Don Master together. So um, it's been really remarkable and I'm really glad that she came. Like I've really been able to um, balance my emotions and um, I've learned how, techniques like how to center myself. I've learned how um, to love myself and appreciate myself and, and just, I just feel complete. And I, I, now I, I, have a, I understand what my purpose is, make a difference. That's really my dream is just to reach people my age we all have such like un uniqueness to each of us and I would just, I would really love for our youth to be more active and passionate 